my sweet souls. Happy Sunday, December 5th. This will be a full length reading on YouTube under Tasha's Divine Guidance. So head over there and check out the full length version when you're finished. If you're interested in scheduling a private reading, it will be in the bio, TikTok, and description for YouTube. Um, I have extended my hours. And um, if you're interested, just uh, follow the link. If not, if you don't have any, um, if you have issues, I mean to say, with the link, just message me. Okay, so we're gonna ask, first we're gonna call on St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender. Anyone sending ill will through thought, word, or action toward myself or the viewer, we're gonna ask the Holy Spirit, angels, and saints, what is coming in our near future for the new year? What advice, what do we need to know for the new year? So what's coming in the new year? So far, I got someone is feeling very trapped, uh, very imbalanced. Um, nothing is going right in their life. They don't want to walk away from you, but you put an end to it and you are protecting yourself from this energy. Wow. This is the new year. What we need to know regarding our new year. gosh guys they keep talking about this past energy this past person that couldn't make a decision that was very selfish self self-absorbed is so unhappy um in player energy nothing is going right for this person oh what positive things can you tell us for the new year please holy spirit holy angels and saints what positive things can you tell us for the new year please holy spirit holy angels and saints So I asked for a positive message. They said, you're healing. You're released from anxiety. You're being divinely guided. You don't care about this manipulator that watches you. You have just energetically released this person. You are blocking any attempt for this person to come back in. And you have a passionate new beginning coming in for the new year. What is this passionate new beginning? What is this passionate new beginning, please? So the passion new beginning is your Ten of Pentacles. You having a committed relationship that is divinely protected. This person is coming into your life that will build a family with you, that will love you, that will support you, that will be devoted to your dreams and passions, and it is divinely protected. You will not be confused moving forward. You will know what it is that you want in your life, in the future. You're going after your own dreams and passions. You're no longer in isolation or hermit mode. Um, you are in this independent, um, wealthy energy. You don't need anyone and you are investing all of your time and attention on yourself and what makes you happy. You are coming out as the lady or man of luxury, standing in your power, proud and confident and not needing anyone. Releasing toxic people places, things, patterns, releasing all toxicity from your life and your future. Not allowing any forward movement from anyone that is in devil energy. Doesn't matter who it is. What you have coming in quick is complete emotional fulfillment. All that you've asked for. Everything that you ever wanted or dreamed in a relationship is what's coming in. You don't care about this person that's defeated that wants to apologize. You have no desire to hear their apology. In the near future, you have moved on. They are in regret. They are in heartbreak. You have moved on. You don't care. This 
person is broken financially. There are no new opportunities coming to this person. You have new financial opportunities coming your way. You have strength, courage, empowerment, along with financial security. That's what's coming for the new year. You have peace. Peace in your life moving forward. Peace in your heart. Renewed hope, healing, wish fulfillment, manifestations coming to fruition. Heightened intuition, divine love. You are the Queen of Cups. You're highly intuitive. You're very empathetic. You're very loving. You're very nurturing. Being in touch with yourself, loving yourself in the near future. You have a commitment. Some of you have a marriage proposal coming in, or this is a committed relationship. Like I said, heightened intuition. You are the high priestess. You are very connected with the divine. You listen to God's guidance. You follow God's guidance. Avoiding the tower mo moment from the past has brought you a lot of clarity in the near future. And it's helped you to release um, any bit of fear that you made any kind of wrong decision or any kind of regret. Um, you're getting clarity on how you walking away from your past really prevented even more damage than what you already went through. You are financially stable, grounded, and secure. You're coming out as the King of Pentacles. In your power, mature, and financially abundant. Those that don't see your worth in the near future, those that don't see that you are the true empress, you're cutting them away. Anyone and everyone. Dropping the burdens of the past completely. Celebrating your life moving forward. <laughs> Celebrating your life with a past life soulmate that is uh, a fire sign, Aries Leo Sag. And the past energy just has to watch in their deceptive energy looking like a fool. Sitting in regret and sorrow. And you don't care, you're not looking back. You don't you're not even tapped into this person's energy anymore. You see from a different perspective everything that you went through and why. And you've embraced it and you know what this person put you through and you're dropping those swords. You're moving on with your life. And this person that played mind games, that played with your heart, they will be surrounded by conflict and drama. This person who was a snake, liar, and a cheat, they're gonna be surrounded by so much drama. You know, all the lies are gonna be exposed while you sit and work on your financial abundance, invest all of your time and attention on your career and uh, becoming more financially secure. And you will be, because this is a gift from the divine, because of all you went through. You don't care who plays the victim. You're over it. You don't care who talks about you. You don't care who lies behind your back. You don't care if they blame you for everything that happened. You are so over it. You're ready to move on and have love and peace and prosperity in your life. And that is what God is bringing you. Because it's your justice. I love you guys. I hope this message helped you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.